everybody it is finally Wednesday I don't know what that means because it's just Wednesday um, close to the weekend maybe um, pretty nice out today it's, it's chilly it's only 39 degrees but it's really sunny I'm just loving the forecast because as the days go on the temperatures are going up and up I might take the storm window out and put the um, the netted one in the back door just so that way I can at least get some fresh air in the house get rid of all the bugs and I'm a little bit moody I'm not gonna lie so I need to turn that around because for the la I've been up since 6 30 but oh yeah, I didn't sleep too well last night this kept bothering me um, and then I didn't tell you yesterday we were playing with Louie on the uh, Roxy on the floor and then Ash I was playing with Roxy on the floor with a bone and then uh, Ash came over and wanted to play with her and Roxy jumped and she uh, she was under me and she jumped right up and I bit my tongue so bad both sides in the back and I was lisping for a good 45 minutes and it was bleeding in the back and it was so annoying so that now my tongue is so sore this morning I feel like it's twice the size it's not but it's just like I keep catching at the back here and because my throat's sore anyway guys Ash is at work she switched shifts they wanted her to get in earlier today so she's gone and Pete's gone, um, won't see Pete tonight because he's going right to um, the other place to work. He finished, he went over last night, he said it'll only be a couple of hours and went over to do the dress rehearsal to get pictures so we can at least get those in the yearbook. The yearbook is done. He says to me last night, come down, look at the pictures. It was like 12.45, I'm like, I'll look at them tomorrow. He said, if you need me to go over stuff, I will do it, but if I can look at them tomorrow, and he goes, well, I'm sending them in so that way we're all done. I'm like, great, it's done. Wrap, wrap, wrap. 2018 yearbook is, well, it's 18 really, isn't it? So, is done. And you know, they've already put up our information for 2019. <laughs> like, can we at least breathe at least for a month in between? I know they like us to do the cover and give them our theme idea over the summer, but it's like, we haven't even, you know, we've just, finished this book and now 2019 schematic or not schematic uh what you call it i don't know the thing that we work with on online so it's up there anyway i can't think of the proper terminology because i'm so mad at the world right now <laughs> anyway i am going to go get another cup of coffee i'm just watching this is 50 shades of mom oh sorry lovey i paused you <laughs> yeah told you guys that i had some she just got back from new york done on my house while I was gone, some painting, a lighting fixture, and some flooring done on my... But she's Fifty Shades of Mum, and I'll leave her link in the description box below so you can go check out her channel if you like. She does hauls and, uh, let me show you real quick. She does, um, oh, it's not gonna show you because I don't want to come out of, it's Fifty Shades, it's fifty five zero, not spelled out. But like I said, I will leave it down below for you. She's in South Carolina. She does a lot of different little things, uh, hauls and, and blogs and all sorts. So yeah, I'm going to continue watching her. But actually, I'm going to go get my coffee first. Then I'm going to continue watching her. According to Pete, the car is fixed. He did all the work on it last night. I, he goes, you can drive it today. I said, nope. He goes, why? So I'm going to leave it 24 hours because he only fixed it. He only glued it last night. I want to make sure. He goes, well, I bought the extra adhesive stuff, so... I said, well, I'm still waiting 24 hours, sorry. Because the minute I hit a bump, especially the way the roads are, there's so many potholes down on the main road. And the thing comes flying off. I don't want it to tear the electrical cause. And I said, how can it be? Because pieces of the glass from the inside of the windscreen came off onto the actual mirror. And he said, it's fine. So, coffee now, finish watching vlogs, edit my own vlog, which I don't know how long it is from yesterday. Put some makeup on my face. Try and cover these bags. Oh my gosh, that one looks all bruised. That's lack of sleep for you. I mean, I have bags anyway, but that is more lack of sleep. Next clip, I will be happier. 
my package from England. I haven't had any news on it in four days and now suddenly it's out for delivery. It arrived and it's out for delivery. So it's one I have to sign for, so I have to listen out for it. Louis pestering to go outside, so I'm gonna go put him outside. <coughs> Roxy, don't start, please, buddy. Um, my computer's bugged up again. It, it's not letting me do anything, and my I've just finished editing the vlog, so I'm hoping it moves to where it's supposed to go. Let me shut the gate so they can't get to the door. Sneezing and coughing, little Louis, aren't you? Put him on his leash in a second and I just want to go and see if there's any messages for me to return. Not a... Oh, what's this? Is this our confirmation that the book is done? Oh, something's up. Oh, not good. All right, Pete's on it. Something about the page is not showing up. That's not good. All right, Pete, Pete's on it, because that part I can't answer anyway, because Pete does the submitting of the pages. I can submit pictures to be done at the lab, but I don't know how to submit that. All right, you going outside, mister? Come on. I keep hearing a car door, so I'll have a quick, put him out and then have a peek and see, and then think about what I'm going to have for lunch. What time is it? There's nothing I can do on my computer while it's all done. I'm going to have to restart it. Oh. It's only 11.09. I think I'll do bacon today. Okay, I've decided on a BLT because <laughs> I look at all my lettuce. This butter lettuce, guys, I'm telling you, is the best. It lasts forever. I have, well, I've got to take a couple of the outside ones off. But I need to go back to Costco and get another pack. Um, so yeah, a BLT is what's going to be for lunch. Hopefully my tomatoes are still good. Otherwise, I'll be disappointed and it'll just be a BT. No, it'll be a BL. No tea, but that is a decision. Uh, what else, Roxy? Oh, I bought this. Avon has come out with a new line of um, health things, which I showed you once before, like the vitamins and stuff. But I actually ordered the clo <laughs> protein powder. <laughs> I got the creamy vanilla, so I'll give that a try and see what I think. Um, it'll be good on days, I think, when we're working long hours outside because you know when I work those leagues, I don't really eat until I get home and then I, it could be like four or five o'clock in the afternoon before I have a morsel of food, especially if there's no loos nearby. And if I don't have Ashley, it's not easy for me to go to the loo at this place because it's down the hill and I'll have to leave the table unattended for about 20 minutes by the time I get down and up. So that had nothing to do with protein powder though, the loo, but you know, the crosses we bear. God, my tongue is so sore. I'm frightened to eat in one way because my tongue is so sore, but I am hungry and my stomach's rumbling. You broke me. She's looking up going, so sorry. All right, let's get this BRT started. Then in the sandwich, we got the toast, but the mayonnaise, the tomatoes cut, the lettuce is washed, and the bacon is done. And it's American bacon I use on my BLTs, as you know. And I think I'll have some soda. I haven't had any soda in a couple of days, so that's pretty good. So there we go. It's all assembled and a bit of extra bacon for the dogs, as usual. <laughs> Yum. Well, that was good timing. My box arrived while I was getting my lunch together. So I'm not going to open it now because I want to go and eat. And I have to put you on charge. The battery's dead already. Took the dogs out. Well, Louis's still out there enjoying the sunshine. I'm going to open this box. Then go upstairs and chill out. <laughs> it feels really nice out. I want to try and bring up this, the... Uh, replace this and put the netted one in. Because, like I said before, it's getting really nice over the next few days. I think it'd be nice to have some fresh air in the house for a change. Then I want to scrub the floors off. Probably do that tomorrow though. Not in the mood for scrubbing floors today besides I don't think my back would let me scrub the floors. Oh, I need to get rid of that tomato juice as well. It's old. Bought it to make Bloody Mary's when it tastes very simple how to Bloody Mary mix, but I never did. And it's just been sitting up there since, so I know it's over its expiration date by far. <laughs> this is my little English haul, and I was so excited to find these uh, cans of lemonade at 70, 70 cents a can and the reason being they're half a size idea I had no clue I didn't even pay attention 
to that when I ordered. I was just like, oh, 70 cents. Ashley loves these. Let me get her 12. Oh, well, these are good mini packs now. So we've got some more of the So Tender. Uh, well, not the So Tender. I haven't tried the So Tender. I got one So Tender paprika chicken. These are all because the Lodge guys introduced me to the So Juicy. So I got a So Juicy paprika chicken. And then I got a So Juicy sticky barbecue chicken. And two of the garlic, which is what, this is one of the ones that uh, Nick and Lee sent over to me and we absolutely loved it. So I got two of those. Pete absolutely devoured the crumpets we got last time. So I got some more of those. I thought Pete would like these because he loves caramel, the cake bars, Cadbury cake bars. And of course I love crunchy, so got some crunchy biscuits. I got a Sun Pat Smooth Peanut Butter, which is delicious. I just put my finger in it. Uh, a Malteser teaser spread for the crumpets. We got one of the Pete Love Shortbread, so I got one of the shorties with chocolate. I uh, got another bag of the chipsticks. There's still half a bag left from last time, but Ashley likes them as well, and they're easy to throw in her bag for work and stuff. So, of course, I had to get some more of the Walkers cheese and onion sorry the lighting in here with the window and um, i got some more of well i didn't get these last time i got some of the smoky bacon got another pack of tea bags because it's a little bit cheaper than buying them in the supermarket here and then ashley loves the chocolate fingers and this is a snack pack again there's five little packs of the mini fingers so that was it really guys hope you enjoy your box of british happiness Thanks to thanks to orders such as yours, we're able to share our passion for British products with the world. We would love to hear from you if you have any questions or feedback. Um, again, thank you, Sally. A treat for a friend, £15 off. A treat for a friend, £15 off on a £75 order. I, can, I have to set up my thing to ref, do referrals. Uh, existing customer don't forget you can get up to 50% off when your friends place orders so I will I'm definitely going to do that because I have had uh, not even just English people ask me about it but other people that have wanted to try some of the British delectables but now I have to find a home for all this stuff I just sent Ashley a picture of this saying no wonder look I can pick up eight I'm so strong um, Oh, what an idiot I am. Well, it's good, I guess, if she just wants a little drink. Uh, she does have some of the bigger cans left, but I will order some of the bigger cans from the other place I ordered from last week. And they'll be here by the weekend. Because she really likes it. And then Pete tried one the other day, and he's like, Oh, I really like this. It's different. Because it's not like Sprite or 7-Up. It's definitely just a nice taste. So I will order some. But yeah, there's my little British corner goods, British corner shop good haul. It's a cup of tea and a biscuit time. First pair. <laughs> she does this and then she looks at herself in the mirror. Roxy, hello. You could give me a back massage while you were there, madam. Nope, she's gone now. Oh, there she is. <laughs> You're Wally. Everybody. <coughs> <coughs> it's quarter to five. I just left over there. The seat is still warm to come sit here for half an hour. Ashley, um, she was 10 to 7 tonight. Then they changed her to uh, 8 to 4. And then they changed her from 4 to 5. So she's 8 to 5. And she just texted. There's a new pizza place opened up. It's called Skinny Pizza. And it's supposed to be good for you. <laughs> you know what I mean? Not... Not as bad for you as a regular New York pizza. You know how big our pizzas are. And it's funny because I was just going to make frozen pizza tonight. Um, but she, they're doing a special because it's it's grand opening. The only thing is she said she wished she'd got it at lunchtime. Because they were only a dollar. And uh, now they're ten. The regular price is ten. They're personal pizzas. That's a lot. I only pay 12 or 13 for the big one. Mm, that's a lot. We'll try it, but that's a lot, actually, for a personal pizza. Because a personal pizza is 
smaller but it, it, it we'll see what it's like anyway it's it we'll see they have so many different toppings you can pick so she'll have plain and I'll have mushroom and onion and they have so many different kinds of mushrooms and onion. so she goes which do you want I'm like huh because <laughs> I'm used to just saying mushroom and onion and you get what you get so I'm having shiitake mushrooms and red onion which will be good so I feel like I got stuff done today I got a few loads of laundry done I did change that window in the back door um, I cleaned the kitchen somewhat I cleaned out one of the the um, cupboards again and you know got rid of some more old stuff that I found food wise oh, what was it oh it was a bag of a packet of biscuits British biscuits digestives with not with the chocolate just plain 2016 how does this happen how did I buy a packet of biscuits and never ate them? My face red, or is it just the lighting? Could be the. I feel like I do feel a bit flushed. I think tonight I'll have a lem sip. Pete, oh, Pete emailed me or texted me. Sorry, the yearbook is done. He sorted that page out with them. Um, it was a miscommunication on their side. They didn't receive his email or didn't see his email. So the yearbook is done. And it's so funny, He, I saw the emails back and forth between him and one of the, our, she's like, you and your wife should go out and celebrate. I thought a chance would be a fine thing because Pete's now working every night this week, <laughs> as he always does. And then next week we'll be getting ready for baseball season. But my friend texted me, I've got to talk to Pete tonight. The last two nights he's been getting home late and I've not thought about it because we've spoken about other stuff. She wants to know if we want to go see a band and have dinner. Um, but it's the night before we have to get up at the crack of dawn. Um, so I'll check with him, see if he's up for it. Roxy must be... What's the matter? Why are you putting your head under there, Rox? Her head must be cold or she's trying to close her ears and not hear me speak. <coughs> anyway, I will give her that, grant her that quiet and I'll talk to you soon. So these are the pizzas. They are a decent size. They're definitely personal pizzas and the crust is thin but Ash was saying you can get whatever kind of crust you want. You can get crust? Wheat, wheat, bread, regular and some other things. The glass is so tall in there that like you have to yell for oh. the girls on the other side. Because <laughs> like they're in such tall. a rough area. It's not like the glass is here. Yeah, it's they made it way too tall. Wow. So I'm like yelling over, <laughs> then you go, so you get the kind of dough, and then she gets it out of the fridge, and then puts all the sauce on that you want. Then you move to the next station, which is like, and they build um, it. chicken, like poultry, and like meats and stuff that you can put on it, and then the next one is all vegetables and oh, wow. stuff. Cool, that looks nice. And then they put a little metal number on it, so when it's in the fry, the... They know whose is whose. Yeah, That's they smart. assign you a number, they put your name... And then they put the little number on it so when it goes in. I wondered if you were going to order online because you can order online as well. Yeah. Okay, so Ash got barbecue chicken or yeah. buffalo? Buffalo. Buffalo chicken and I got mushroom and onion. So and I got a lemonade. And she got a lemonade, her favorite <laughs> lemonade. Just under 30 bucks. <laughs> yeah. Or Louie. You know. Oh, hi guys. It is 10 o'clock. I just took the dogs out and then Pete called while I was outside saying he's on his way home. What did you find to eat, madam? Shouldn't be anything down there for you to eat. Uh, Louis scared me half to death. He stayed downstairs for ages when Ash and I first came up after we ate. And uh, about 40 minutes later, I'm like, i got to go check on him. Couldn't find him anywhere. And he was under the conference table in the office. And that to make sure he was breathing. Of course, <laughs> I disturbed him then. And he got restless and <laughs> everything else. Oh dear, but he's asleep now on the bed because he's just been out, so Pete can come home, have some dinner. But I know he'll go on the computer and start editing the files that he's just worked on. But anyway guys, I think that's going to be it for today. Pete just pulled in the driveway, I can hear him, so the dogs are going to start barking as soon as they hear the car door. So I'm going to love and leave you for today. I hope you've had a wonderful day and I will see you later. Good night. Mm -hmm.